Hi, and welcome to 50 Days of Keynote, 50 Things You Can Create for the Classroom. Today is my turn, Alicia Bankofa, bringing you day 21, how to use Keynote to create a lyric poster. What exactly is that? Well, you're essentially designing a poster with font or with text, and you want to use these texts or fonts as a graphic element to communicate a message or convey an emotion. So there's definitely more text than image on this poster. Keynote is perfect for this because you can not only use the standard fonts, you can add custom fonts and you can create some really cool dynamic designs if you want to animate them. How do you actually add a custom font? I'm going to show you how to do this. You get a font app from the App Store and you install the fonts from the library to the iPad. So these are some font apps you can use. I used any font. So what you do is you tap on the font you want to install. You say, okay, allow. Confirm it by closing, then you're going to go to general and go to profiles. You install the profile that you want to install. Then you say next, you confirm by saying install. Then you go back to your fonts part of the general and you can see all the installed fonts. Adding text is also really easy in Keynote. So you just press plus, you choose the third option from the left text. Then you can type in your text and um, add um, effect so you can change the font you can make it bigger you can make it uh, colorful you can add outlines lots of effects so prepare the lesson by deciding to uh, help the students by explaining to them what their job is so I did this in design but you can do it in music and English as well so the students should choose a song and they could take either part of the lyrics or all the lyrics and create a nice poster out of it I showed them some examples of Pinterest. You can use a Pinterest search just to see uh, what kind of lyric posters are designed um, by other people. And then I explained what I wanted them to do by just giving them these instructions in Keynote as well. They used even a word cloud generator to get some ideas. And I gave them also an idea what I created myself just so they could know what I wanted from them. So here is what my students created, some lovely songs. They all did it by themselves and they manipulated the text. They made them bigger, made them different colors, different sizes and different shapes because they really tried to convey a really cool message or emotion via their, their posters. And there it is, there you have it. 50 days of Keynote. Find all videos here and all Keynote files here.